<laughs> well, oh, Monday night, Cindy Lauper, uh, Alexandria, Alexandra Penny, she wrote a book called How to Keep Your Man Monogamous. <laughs> so don't miss it. It should be interesting. That's all right. That's enough. Oh, the call is on, too. It's going to be a good, good Monday night. <laughs> you ready for this? My next guest manages two, not one, but two of the baddest World Wrestling Federation. <laughs> Nasty men. Randy Macho Man Savage. <laughs> and Zeus. Please welcome Sensational Sherry. <laughs> You're a manager right to the end. You're right. From one end of my body to the other. Mm, mm, mm. Okay, Sherry, let's talk wrestling. Let's now, talk. you were the female champion. I certainly was. And you're no longer wrestling? Uh, when I get the chance. I was expecting that when she tweeted. Oh, guys. <laughs> um. <laughs> You get Hi. nervous when people Yes, I do. I, I get very nervous. You shy. Uh, Sweating. Yeah. Makeup. <laughs> How do you stack up to, like, a manager such as the lovely Elizabeth? That's a very dirty word, Arsenio. Well, I just have to ask the question. Let me ask you. Okay, folks, look at this. I have the body of a Greek goddess. What are you laughing about? <laughs> what is this? It's my audience, and, and this is America. They have an opinion. Okay, it's your own opinion. Okay. <laughs> the difference between Elizabeth and myself is I am woman from the top of my head to the bottom of my toes. I don't. Wait a minute. I don't have roving eyes, except for the macho man from the top of his from the top of his head to the bottom of his toes. Okay, no, okay. Now, wait a minute, I'm not okay. finished yet. I'll let you go. But see, I only need one man. That's all I need. The macho man does everything that I need. I don't need two or three, like uh, bimbo, champagne. So you're involved yeah. with the Elizabeth. macho man personally out of the ring? I didn't say that. Well, you, you said, did. Now, wait a minute. You can't, when you say, I only need one man, since that's you do it. also manage Zeus, that's two that's men, right, so you must two. be talking about your personal life. No, I'm not. You said that. I didn't. Well, wait a minute. Macho man, yeah. Zeus. That's yeah. two men. That's a... <laughs> This is America, so everybody gets their opinion. Yes, I had, I managed two men. Uh-huh. That's right. And you're trying to say you and Macho Man never did the wild thing? That's not... <laughs> okay. Not that that's any of your business. Well, I, I got to ask the question, Sarah. That's my job. Okay, go ahead. Ask your question. Okay. Uh, I should also ask you about the rumor that one of the reasons you don't like Hulk is you approached him, not only as a woman, but you approached him to manage him, and he rejected you. Wait a minute. Let's get one thing. You, if I'm, if I'm not mistaken, we're at the last Los Angeles show. Oh, I don't miss a wrestling match. Yeah, okay. Well, then look at this. <laughs> That's one big point, right? Okay. Other than the fact that being that, you know, you're a very good-looking man... <laughs> and uh, that you never, <laughs> and that you never miss a wrestling show. <laughs> you saw Hulk Hogan put his hands on my person. Yes. And would you like for me to tell you why? You have your everything that you're talking about is construed. Mm -hmm. Hulk Hogan wants me. He wants me to manage him. Mm -hmm. 
the reason that he put his hands on me is because he wants everything that the macho has, he, macho man has. He is so very jealous of macho man, it is pathetic. And he wants everything that everyone else has too, darling. He's a very greedy man. That's why he has Elizabeth. Do I not have good faith for He wants everything the macho man has. Okay. But there's something that Hulk Hogan will never have. What? Me. And you know, you, you, wait, his, wait. he is nothing but a paper champion. Mm. And that is going to be proven very shortly at SummerSlam. Baby, I saw Hulk Hogan at the sports arena here lift you up, slam you down on his knee, body slam you, throw you over the ropes into the table, your head hit the bell. Okay. <laughs> okay. And let me ask you. And you know what? And you know what? I hear him. Wait. I hear the madness. He's here. Oh, I hear God. Him. Hey, and he went, I hear him. Macho! Where are you? I hear him. Can't you? Can't you hear him? Um, He's here. Ah! I hear Okay. We'll take a commercial and we'll be right back with <laughs> You know what? How many have heard another name other than Sensational? Yes. No, I just heard at the sports arena when you were, well, that's it, baby. Don't talk. Okay. <laughs> I just heard people call you, no, no, people I call you call sensational Sherry, they call you constipated Sherry, they call you a coconut. I heard that. I heard that. You know, you really have a lot. Hey, I was just listening to the fans, you know. Considering the fact that I thought this was the greatest talk show. Well. I mean, you are the best. Well, this is what I heard, Sherry. I didn't make this up. I didn't make this up. I heard people I say heard sensational. Feelings. Hey. I didn't make it up, Sherry. Oh. Sherry, I think you're sensational. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Do you really? I, I, I loved you as a wrestler. You were the best. And um, right now, you seem to be doing pretty well as a manager. I certainly am. I'm about to bring out one of your biggest clients, probably Ooh. your biggest client physically. Oh, yeah. What do you think of Zeus? I think Zeus is the most magnificent human wrecking machine of all time, and also the star of No Holds Barred. Yeah. Marla, can we look at a clip of Zeus for those who aren't big wrestling fans? Let's see this clip, Sandy. Yeah. Let's bring out the man mountain, her man mountain, Could I ask him a couple questions? <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> I'll tell, put it this way. Ask him at your... Uh... Your own risk? Yeah. Zeus. Mr. Zeus. Mr. Mr. Zeus. <laughs> My brother.
were in the movie and now you've developed this the no no holes barred is the name of the movie you're in this movie with hulk hogan and somehow uh you all haven't been getting along what is the problem your friend that you had on the show a month ago my brother is a paper champion He's a very insecure person. I am the real star of No Host Bar. Zoom star. Yeah. Don't piss me yeah. off. Don't piss me off. machine and nobody is going to holler cut. Zeus, you're a big man. Mr. Zeus. Mr. Zeus. <laughs> Mr. Zeus, you're a big man, but do you have the wrestling skills that it takes to handle a whole whole? Let's get on uh, a personal tip, uh, more about Zeus the man. Um, did your parents name you Zeus? Were you Zeus from birth? <laughs> okay, wait. Okay. okay. No, that's not a good question. He's not going to bite you. That's not a good question. He won't bite you. It's not a good question, maybe. Um, Mr. Zeus? <laughs> I, you know, let's be friends, man. Let's relax. Let's talk. We're both underdogs. Let's kind of just uh, kick it, man. Why did you have that jump on your show, brother? He's the champ, man. He's the champ. He's the champ. He's the champ. I'm gonna get you. Let's go, guys. Come on. 